I'm joined by Mitch Rapson, who has just won by unanimous decision. Mitch, run us through how that fight went, played out for you. Uh, the first round was pretty slow. Um, tried to find my footing. He was cracking me with some big shots. He had a fair bit of power, which I knew. Second round, um, started to get my own stuff off. Got that, surprised he survived that submission at the end of the second, thought I had that. And then, um, yeah, third round was just, I thought it was pretty 50-50. Like, I knew it was tired, I was trying to push through, but yeah, it worked out in the end. And what did your corner say to you at the end of round one for you to turn the whole fight around? I could feel, I could feel he was already gassing after that first round, taking deep breaths, and they pretty much confirmed it with me. They said, look at him, like, he's, he's tired, so I just had to... Had to trust myself a bit more and start going. Um, I don't even know how we ended up in that. I ended up in the top top position, but that was what won me the round, I reckon. And you quit your job to pursue MMA. How have you been finding that? Yeah, it's it's different. Um, I used to be a full time plumber, and now I still work part time. But yeah, just so I can train full time, really. So it's um it's a big step, but yeah, it's a bit of sacrifice, but it's worth it in the end for the moments like these. So. That's, that's why I do it. It is a big sacrifice to be making. So what can we expect from you in the future? Hopefully just more fights, following my boy Taser Malone's route. And hopefully just keep banging them out. Um, I want to stay pretty active next year, obviously. Take the Christmas period off and then hopefully the March card back here. Um, and then, yeah, hopefully have, I reckon, a m minimum three, four or five next year. Well, we can't wait to see you back in action. Congratulations on the win and enjoy the Christmas period.